Hello everyone, welcome to Swaret Advisors. I am Siddharth Verma and today in this video we will gonna learn about the procedure of trademark objection in India. So let's start with the topic. Trademark objection in India is considered to be the most crucial and important stage for the registration of trademark. Therefore, after filing the application for registration of trademark, the official specifically examines them and analyze the same application. However, the registration of trademark application can be rejected by the authority on various grounds if they deem fits to do so. Many times during the process of trademark registration, the trademark registrar may raise objections on the intended trademark if it seems to violate any rules and laws of trademark registration. So now let's discuss about the grounds of trademark objections through an application for trademark registration. Can face objections like incorrect use of trademark form, wrong use of the applicant's name, failure in the filling of the trademark form, false address on the trademark application, inaccurate specification of goods and services, when the trademark being already registered, lack of distinctive character and deceptive or misleading trademarks displayed. So let's understand who can file for trademark objection as mentioned under section 21 of the Trademark Act 1999. Any person file for the objection of trademark. This may include individuals, companies, partnership firms and trusts. However, if two or more persons have similar issues against any particular trademark to be registered, they can join together as opponents, also any author or the owner of any earlier trademark application covering trademarks for similar goods and a person who has already used similar trademark before the claim, but has not sought registration of the trademark can file the trademark objection. So the next topic for the discussion is what is the time period for trademark objection? So any third party can file for the objection of trademark within the period of three months, which may be extended to an additional one month from the date of publication of such trademark. So now let's understand where can notice for trademark objection be filed. So the notice for the purpose of trademark objection can be filed at the trademark registry where the application for the trademark in the conflict has been earlier filed. Thus, it can be stated that if an application is filed at Delhi office, then the proceeding for objection of trademark should also be initiated at Delhi office only. So now let's understand step by step the procedure for trademark objection in India. So first step is the notice for trademark objection that should be filed by any person that has already been advertised and published in the trademark journal within four months from the date of advertisement. Second step is the counter statement. Under, under this, the applicant can file for the counter statement within two months from the date of the script of notice of trademark objection. If not done so, the applicant seems to have abandoned the trademark application. Third step is the evidence in favor of objection. Under this, the applicant may, by way of an affidavit, can file for the evidence in favor of the objection of trademark. The applicant can also write to the registrar of the trademark stating that the applicant does not want to file evidence but instead intends to rely upon the facts stated in the notice for the trademark objection. Fourth step is the evidence to be submitted in favor of reply under this under the opponent party is provided with a duration of one month which may extend for a period of another one month in order to file for evidence in response to the applicant's evidence. And the last step is the final hearing. Based on all of the above points and the evidence produced and submitted, the registrar shall call for the hearing. The parties within period of 14 days from the date of receipt of notice of hearing shall notify the registrar for their appearance. In the matter, thus the matter is then heard by the registrar of the trademark and then decided on the basis of merits. Now, day come for the final decision. After the hearing on the matter, the registrar finally delivers the decision. If the decision is in favor of the applicant, then such application is registered as per the Trademark Registration Act. 
although if the decision is against the applicant such trademark are considered to be objected by the registrar so we have discussed the topic on procedure of trademark objection in india in very comprehensive manner so i hope this video helps you to understand the forced topic for more ipr related videos do subscribe our channel thank you